There are 32 First Nations languages indigenous to British Columbia. Such good This is my mom, the Chilcotin language teacher. Oh, it's on the end. She's famous back home because <laughs> her name is in all of the language textbooks. She drove me insane as a kid because she would tape Chilcotin over all the words in my books. And this is my Atu, my grandmother. She only speaks Chilcotin. Atu, huh? anything. <laughs> She's the smartest person I know, mostly because she never went to school. And there's me, the 31-year-old who on a good day sounds like she's five. I know it's great for comic relief, but come on. A linguist mom, a monolingual grandmother? Where did it go so wrong? When you entered school, um, you start coming home and telling me, Mom, speak English, speak English. You want it so bad to be like everybody else at school. Also, I was taken to the residential school at six years old. Mm -hmm. And so they made us feel bad about our language and our culture and the way we were. And it really affected me. So it was easy for me to switch over when my daughter said, speak English. Like, what can I do to get you to talk Chilcotin to me now, all the time? Teach you as a student. One, two, three. Pony stay. It's Anna's day. Pony stay. It's Asa. Nina go. She's sure. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to I need a socialistic. I need a socialistic. I was understandable. We were understandable, though. <laughs> so I should keep practicing and not worry about being laughed at? Mm. Yeah. Yeah? 